All right, Shalom. I'd like to start this video off by giving all praises to the Most High, Yahweh, by Hashem Yahushai, by Hashem Rakah, Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and the others, a great millstone. Salutations to Akim out there that pushed this word in truth and in sincerity. Um, brother, you around your head, just want to do this quick, impromptu, quick lesson from the book of Micah, chapter 7. Um, and it says this uh, from verse 7 Therefore, I will look unto Yahweh, I will wait for the power of my salvation. My power will hear me. Rejoice not against me, O my enemy. When I fall, I shall arise. When I sit in darkness, Yahweh shall be a light unto me. I will bear the indignation of Yahweh, because I have sinned against him. Until he plead my cause and execute judgment for me, he will bring me forth to the light, and I shall behold his righteousness. So yeah, man. Um, pretty much we sinned against the Most High, you know. So therefore, we have to bear the indignation, man. But you know, whilst bearing this indignation, it's a twofold effect because we're learning wickedness on this side, and in the kingdom, we will attain perfect righteousness. This, or I should say, thus making us a god. Or powers man Meaning that we possess perfect righteousness And we have learnt perfect evil Therefore we can judge all matters Therefore we are qualified judges in the kingdom Or will be Yahweh Tazar, Lord willing And as for our enemies It says rejoice not against me Because when we fall I shall arise man And the Lord is arising his elect He's raising his house He's calling his small sanctuary Or his little sanctuary as he said in the book of Ezekiel Chapter 3 I believe You know So This is a quick encouragement to brothers To Continue To To practice patience man Because the Lord is raising us up If we do What he says in sincerity and in truth It would make the Lord Not a man of his word To fail us And the Lord has never Not kept his word and never, The Lord has never Failed his word man He's always seen it through Why? For his name's sake As he says in his word so, you know, in the spirit, man, just do what's required of you, man, you know. As I strive to do what's required of me, and Yahweh Tazar will make it, man, you know. But as for now, we've got to bear that indignation of Yahweh, man, you know, because we have sinned against him. But, you know, Rakatei Haub HaShem Yahshai, Thawada Yahweh Shai, for being that sacrifice, that ultimate sacrifice <clears throat> for the elect and essentially for all of Israel, man, so that we have a chance of being redeemed and brought back to the Most High. So with that, I'll just like to leave you with that quick thought and reminder. I'll say shalom.